Good morning, y'all. We're gonna do a little hook, hook and book. So uh, hopefully you can see this. Sorry that took so long, but uh, yeah, one man camera crew. But now I have to be back under. It's real simple. What I try to do is I'll just line the tires up with the edge of the trailer. Super easy. The thing about these is if you're off a little bit, don't worry about it because it'll it'll put it in the hole. I mean. You can't be super far off, but a couple inches won't hurt you. We got to hook up these glad hands. Very simple, you know. Oh. I'm not making it look too simple now, am I? But same stuff every day you want to make sure that this little hook here is hooked in so it can't pull out grab your other glad hand it's red and red blue and blue you can't uh you can't really mess that up um then you come over here with this particular fifth wheel if you see this handle right here if that's all the way in the sucked in position, you are hooked. Um, again, in the morning, make sure you're checking your tires. You gotta kick them or get a club or something, because looking at them will be deceiving. Um, another thing too, with these, uh, right here, if it's raining, 
these handles will be full of water so make sure you're shaking them off otherwise you're gonna get soaked um, I gotta actually unload and load this trailer so I'm not gonna do everything this morning um, but same old stuff different day um, yeah I'm gonna try to get some more stuff so I can get some better angles for you guys cuz I know when I was trying to get my CDOs little stuff like hooking the glad hands up uh, using the fifth wheel real little stuff that I was looking for and I was kind of hard to find some of them I mean they're on there don't get me wrong but you see how all these trailers and how close they are you don't have much room in between some places are even worse than this you got to be able to back up and park these trailers in between these so just keep that in mind guys and uh, we'll see you later <laughs>